Hi, Vesha. How are you? I'm fine, sir. What about you, sir? I'm good as well. So, Vesha, uh, very congratulations from ILTS Ninja that you have got your visa. So, how excited are you? As I can see, you're on yes, the airport. You will be landing in Canada very soon. So, yeah. how excited you are? Yeah, the, yeah, my excitement all thanks to the Ayurveda uh, Health Ninja team because they work hard, especially on my SOP, especially Subdev ma'am, even it is Afrin ma'am and the whole team, especially I uh, in Ninja head who guided me, who supported me every time, even if the rejection also in the second time also, third time they supported me, they give me a chance that okay you put and after that but all over the video, it's all of the team work, especially the head sir who guided the yes definitely who promoted and who guided most importantly that how I think that like they can turn the tables of the rejection person definitely even it is a five time or deal with uh, uh, the child uh, students SOP and everything and sequential wise that is most that really, that's the important thing which I have found out and I am very much thankful to Ice Ninja, YouTube team and I believe that if you got a rejection, I recommend that you should go for Ice Ninja rather than any other agency because they will not they will not leave your hand until and unless if you get the positive results. That's from my side. So even like uh, this one quick question. You got a multiple rejection and you were completely yeah. demotivated. Even even I see that yeah. your family was also stressed out. Take my how how my son will going to travel because he's having a rejection already one time. So why did you, you know, trust on us and you know proceed further? How was the process like exactly? Your experience. Yeah. Um... All of a sudden, I got the information from uh, from my institute. Like one person came and he just recommended this contact this person. So that person, that was a lady, and I think that was an uh, for me it was an angel, like a god's angel or like something like that. You can say that, and uh, that showed me the part that you can contact you for Ayush Ninja. Just have a word with them. And I just had a word with them. I don't. I I neither know that who is YouTuber I was thinking. Neither Google or just search on YouTube. I just blindfolded took a risk that okay, this much I have done. Now I'll take the risk for that because first rejection I was so much demotivated. And after that I told my father that there is an agency of YouTuber. I don't know them, but I I wish that I want to trust them because the way uh, the management or the team who try to communicate with me who move. Boasted my morale that okay, no worries, but we are there. In any other consequences, we are there to support you, support you, whether it's your rejection or even if your SOP or anything, we are ready. The most important thing which my family are very much grateful to that. Whenever we called you for IELTS Ninja, uh, even if they miss the call, they revert back. That is the uh, like um, what we can say that the. Uh, a special service they are providing, or we can say that the service the UK wise media because other agencies they will deny the call or they will say that we are an amazing something like that, which I have experienced many. But UK wise media, I have never complained about that because even if I call Subdev ma'am or Afreen ma'am or anyone X Y Z of UK wise, they will definitely revert that and they will call. The service is fabulous, fantastic. They will clear and sort out the doubt, but yes, uh, it will take time. The reason is that the taking of the time as they are mostly checking uh, ink and everything very much really. Other agencies don't get, get into it. They just simply okay. Like former my agency, I'm not taking the name because the big privacy ones are well known. Eh? They just took my SOP. They never read it out. They just simply copy paste and put it in the IRCC. But here it was totally different. They took my idea. Yes, sir. So Vaishak, as you have mentioned, uh, SOP was a key point. Okay. So yes. could you please explain brief to other candidates how important an SOP is in visa process and how the other consultancies yes. deal that visa SOP, which is a very critical document, because of that many candidates got a refusal and they are not able yeah. to understand the fact that if you do a small mistake in your visa SOP your rejection chances increase so how you can actually cut off that rejection chances and increase the level of acceptance that your visa can be can you please throw some light on that yeah. 
Yeah, it's a very good question. It's a very genuine question. These days, Canada students are getting this type of rejection due to their improper SOP that they are providing in front of IRCC. But here in UK, Brazil, Ninja, which I have found out that once they ask you certain questions regarding your study or anything, if you are to the point you are providing the answer on that basis, they will reframe the sentence and according to that basis because certainly the grammatical and that other things which the students are not capable of writing, they just simply write it and simply send to the other uh, agency and which they definitely not read it. They just simply just. It's just one way go through it just to make a simple grammatical question. But here it's totally different. They will mention each and everything very much specifically so that the IRCC officer, okay, he gets an eye of it. Okay, what is to the point? Here it is to the point, not round round. Nothing is there. It is to the point and up to the mark where the IRCC and, uh, officer gets the satisfied, gets the SOP up to the mark. Yes, definitely the uh visa and apart from that there are other certificates like which i have got like uh, especially the comeback certificate like affidavit and uh ca report that was very important like some agencies they will say that that is not required but here in ielts ninja they will ask for affidavit that's a very crucial thing because especially the coming affidavit which is from made from the government uh, official government official signed by the notary uh, lawyer and uh, which is signed by the student so that that they will give a more effort here definitely he will come back for the son or what definitely so that's a very important factor then second thing about the ca report that is very important because in the irtc or the officers they must know that after coming back whether he has the access to survive that is very important factor and especially uh, the important thing about the mother's uh, parents uh, income details that is also uh, revenue details also that and most importantly the sop will uh, because uh, there are many uh, lawyers uh, like immigration lawyers who will guide them based on the students uh, criteria what is their requirement on that big basis they will prepare it this uh, i'm not saying that uh, you people are in india preparing a sop it takes time three yeah. i just want to ask you yeah i just want to ask one question to you that uh, if yes. any candidate who got a refusal from canada or rejection mm-hmm. from canada what are the three important step which that candidate has to follow so that you know they can actually convert that refusal letter into an acceptance letter first of all if that candidate is asking me a suggestion i will say this that uh, you contact you favor ielts ninja first of all first thing i will say that you contact you favor ielts ninja second thing find out and figure out what was your previous reason how you made the sop take a uh, take a soft copy of that sop and forward it to you favor ielts ninja third thing what is the main cause of your refusal and fourth thing just uh, be calm and patient there while working with you for writing the because they are not in a one hour hot pot they will prepare an sop in one day they will take time because they will study your file they will study your file whether your course is up to the mark or is there anything left because some students are very in a hurry hurry i'll give quote an example that one of my uh, friend was also there so he was also in a bit hurry hurry but i told him that don't then do the experiment process but being come to being telling frankly things thing that no doubt you for i see the way take time but they will give you a positive result that is the plus point about you for i will see that even it is a five time or six time rejection don't worry just trust them they are the poor they are the so i shall we won't disturb you more because you are having a wonderful time on airport So just tell me, uh, can you please uh, turn on your ca- uh, uh, camera towards like where exactly you are standing and uh, how soon you will be landing in Canada? Uh, I just um, just one minute. Yeah, there is no option here. Just one minute. You can just turn off, uh, turn your uh, camera, selfie camera only. You can. Yeah. Yeah, I am here. Yes, sir, I am in the. Yeah, Vaisha, can you please show your where you are standing? Yeah, I am in Kuchin Airport. I am in Kuchin Airport. Perfect. And how soon you will be landing? Uh, I will be uh, landing on twenty ninth uh, at seven fifty at Kuchin Airport. 
That's great. That's great. So I hope like I will going to receive a selfie once you there in Canada. Wish you all the best, Vesha, and we will connect back Thank once you, again very soon for your PR process. So, and yeah, and importantly, if anyone any candidate come to me, I'll definitely refer you. So I will. I'll Thank you so much, Vesha. Thank you so much, Vesha. Wish you all the best for your future, and we will be the person who will be assisting you for your PR process as well. Hope to connect with you very soon. Yeah, sir. All the best for your future. Sure, sure, definitely. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Have a great day, dear. Bye bye.